<laughs> All right, folks, we are back with another live today. And today is really special because uh, we are going to go ahead and interview one of our patients who's gone through and worked with Green Relief. All right. So uh, her name is Chastity, and we're just waiting uh, to get her on here. We're just going to let the live go for just a minute. And uh, we're going to get her on the interview process, let her explain uh, what's worked for her, what's been special, and uh, what she's done to, to help all of her problems. Um, now, if you haven't done so already, go ahead and give us a call. Set up your appointment with one of our doctors um, and get yourself started on the medical marijuana. Um, we have a ton of products coming out. We've got CBD oil. We've got, uh, we've got a bunch of new exciting things coming. So we have two, uh, I believe... To two or three uh, locations in Tampa. We have three locations here in Orlando, and then we have two locations down in Fort Lauderdale. So please give us a call, set up an appointment with an office that's closest to you, and get uh, the process started. Take advantage of this. Uh, there's too many people getting hooked on um, these pharmaceuticals, these drugs. Uh, it's ruined a lot of lives, and it's, uh, it's, it's time that we come up with an alternative solution, and that's what Green Relief is here. Okay, so Green Relief is here for uh, medical marijuana, and uh, we want to make sure it's done right, and that's why uh, we're encouraging you to do this. All right, and so that's why we're we're having these interviews. We're going to go ahead and have Chastity jump on. All right, so. And again, sorry if you're uh, following this live with us. We're just having some technical difficulties. We're just uh, trying to link up with Chastity, and we're going to get uh, get her uh, to tell her story about how Green Relief has helped uh, her life and uh, the things that she's overcome to make sure that she can live uh, the best life that she possibly can. So again, we're just waiting on that, just waiting for uh, things to link up here. And if you have any questions, please jot them down uh, in the comments below and I can answer those. Um, and uh, that's what we do these Facebook Lives for. If you have a suggestion for what we should go over and what we should talk about, uh, give us, or just send us a, a message, write a comment. Um, you know, make sure you follow us on Instagram and our YouTube channel. Everything that we do here um, on the Facebook Live, I download it, I upload it to uh, YouTube. And so that way you can go back, you can watch these, and uh, and make sure you, you stay up to up to date with all of the the news. Perfect. We've got Chastity on here. All right. Let's see here. All right. Let's see. Just making sure. Founders to send a view request to join your broadcast. That's right, perfect. Okay, so Chastity is on. All right, perfect. Second. All right. Hello. How are How you doing? doing? You good in yourself? I'm doing I'm wonderful. Hold on one, one second. I'm making a joke here. here. Let me. I got. I got. I got a bucket of money. That thing as well. Hold on. All right. Perfect. Can you hear me? Yeah. All right, perfect. All right, perfect. All right. All right. so Ms. So Chastity, Chastity, so what I want to do today, today is pretty much pretty find much out find what out you've gone through, gone through um, uh, with Green Relief and, really and how can how you can help you. Yeah. So, so tell us a little bit about what you were going, going through um, before you met with Green Relief. Um, so far, I was going through a struggle for two years of nonstop seizures, having um, epilepsy. I'll catch them like six times a day. Um, unfortunately, it took a big toll on my family because my husband had to stop working because he had to watch me to make sure I was okay. Um, I was always um, 
the you know how the hospital goes they'll help you try to give you medication and different types of things but the problem with the hospital was they'll give you 10 different medications but none of them seems related to my issue that was going on in my head with my brain waves so one time my husband was like okay let me try this because i've been searching and so far a little new speed and he had gave me um the weed or whatever it stopped my seizures for a few it like calmed me down completely and i like woke up the next minute not knowing anything but it was kind of helping me so then i was like okay so from new york i moved down to florida and was like might as well see what this you know this is about and stuff he started doing more research and things like that for me and then i met up with frank rodriguez the doctor and he was giving me on he was giving me some pointers on um what's good for me to use with the cbd and things like that and so far i literally been three months straight with that one the only time i would catch a seizure would kind of be if like i'm really stressing about something or if like i'm really angry or something like that and i trigger it myself basically other than that it's controllable and so far i've been perfect to do anything all in about i'm never tired i can run around and be happy and not worry uh, that i'm gonna catch a seizure no, that's, that's awesome. awesome so, so um, when, when you, you first met with dr frank rodriguez um uh, how was that, that process were you a little, a little nervous, nervous or, or how, I mean, was, how was that it's kind of it's it's kind of nerve wracking because you really like, you're just jumping into something new. You feel me? And then it's like, everybody always has judgmental upon it. You get me? Once they hear medical marijuana, they just look up the bad outcomes and what others used to take a band abusive with. And then I just saw it as like, what if this is like the actual key, like to it? The only thing I am afraid of is like, um, how can I say? If we don't ever have it no more, maybe then we'll probably be stuck with really taking all these different kind of medicines. But other than that, it wasn't as bad. They kind of made me feel so comfortable. Everybody was so friendly and just laughter. It wasn't a hard process either. So it was like kind of easy for me. Awesome. Awesome. So after the first appointment, uh, how long was it before you set up the other one? And and then, and then how long did it take you to get your card? card? It actually was like the next week I did it. Like literally, like I was like, hey, the next week, let's set up the appointment for the second visit. And um, it basically like it goes by when you kind of want it, when you feel comfortable. Because your first visit, it's like you're just conferencing, just talking about it, just opening. It's a basically like an open mind or things like that of what's this and what's that and going how the process and talking about the process so my next appointment i was like available like i did it as soon as possible because i wanted to get going and it took me no lie at least three weeks to get my card but that's only because um i had did a change of address so with that being said i didn't get to tell them in time and stuff like that so that's the only reason why but other than that it wasn't that bad cool cool, cool. cool. that's what i like, I like to hear, to hear. So, so when, when you got, got everything set up, set up how, uh, how did, did the doctors work with you as far as making recommendations, recommendations and then, then what, what did they recommend for you? Um, well, first things first is he always has a paper on front of his desk that shows a plan. Um, it basically shows um, how to use your products in the sense of morning, night, afternoon, things like that. Like it's just like a little plan, a little grid. And he starts from the grid and basically works his way up. So with me, since I'm epileptic, he knows right away that what he needs to focus on is making sure that if I catch a seizure, it'll calm me down or it will relax me in a sense of just, you know, taking over my body or whatever. But how can I say he, it was just like, he just recommend me to like the best of his ability of what he thought would can like really help me in the sense of since how many times I catch a seizure and stuff like that. And since it was already like a, a grid there to rule follow by, I kind of just left it that way because since he already has it and it's been working, I didn't want to like change it up or anything else like that. And that's basically it. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, yeah so, so he, he, he pretty, pretty much, much knew right off the bat. Yeah, like, like he just knew off the backhand, on. like, right away. Awesome, awesome. 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 So, um, so um, now, have, have you, you talked to, talk him, to him, him since, since that, that second, second appointment? appointment? Uh, yeah, I had another, I had an extra visit appointment with him, and then the last time I heard he kind of got sick or whatever, so... I know there was going to yeah, be a yeah. new doctor coming in and stuff like that. So I'm the first to have an no appointment with a new doctor and see how that goes. I'm not going to lie. I'm not too comfortable having so many doctors, but it was, like, understandable. Mm -hmm. And I kind of, like, kind of hurt my heart. But, I mean, whatever is best for him and if he can get himself healthier, I don't care. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's a big, big thing. thing. You know, you know, but, but I, I, going, going back, back to you, you um, what's, what's been, been one of your go-to go products, products that you use on a daily basis? basis? Um, I'm not going to lie. I use the uh, THC flower pods. Okay. That's a go-to due to the fact that it, like, I find out my triggers. I have triggers. I know when I'm going to catch a seizure or not. Like, I feel it between my toes or one of my, like, one of my legs starts spazzing and things like that. So the first thing I do is tell my boyfriend to go ahead and get my flower pods for me, and that's when I'll start, you know, using the products and things like that. I go ahead and roll up my flower pod, and it eases me completely. I go ahead and put three drops of um, CBD oil, um, a full gram of my, of my drops, and I'll be perfect for the day. Good, 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 good. Now, now um, um, so you so take, you take that, that, is, is um, it, it, generally it generally takes, takes like, like what, what, maybe a couple, a couple minutes? minutes? Um, for, a, for the flower pod, it takes literally as soon as I basically tap it on your lips, like as soon as you okay, need okay. to like, it, it triggers right away. That's one thing I can say, it goes right away. The drops, you can't feel anything that much because it is CBD, but I know that it's helping me because later on, like, as time is going, I don't feel anything, and I don't get, like, my spasms anymore. Like, I just be relaxed, and it's just, like, mine will be somewhere else. Like, it'll just be, like, okay, back to normal type of stuff. Mm -hmm. so, so what's, what's been, been the, the biggest, biggest benefit, benefit that, that uh, you've, you've had, had just from, from, I mean, obviously living, living a normal, normal life, life again, again. Uh, what's, what's, what's been, been the biggest thing you've looked forward to, to, to um, you know, you have this product to... to Live in normal life again. Um, let's first things first is I'm glad that I can sleep again. Period. Um, I used to wake up a lot, and I know I noticed that I used to have a lot of pain and headaches towards me waking up a lot, catching seizures at nighttime is the most times. But I'm glad like I can have relief of sleeping, and not only that, that I'll be able to function and kind of lately remember things from before. So that's something that I kind of like, it made me like open eyes type of thing because it's like that's a really big effect that I always had that I'll never forget. Like I always forget things and I will never remember something. And it took time, but I mean, so far I've been great, literally. Yeah, yeah, yeah I can I imagine. imagine. Uh, uh, so, so what's what's, what's the, the next step for you? I mean, no. um, are you going, going to keep doing what you're doing? doing or, no, uh, I'm actually going to try. Um, there's this this um concentrate one that they have now um in um true relief it's a dispensary um it's called the one-on-one -on -one. so i want to talk to my new doctor about that because i think with just the one-on-one -on -one, i wouldn't be having to put two and two together like mm -hmm. as in just have the oil and then the flower pods i can just use the flower pods to go to sleep and use the one-on-one -on -one during the day and see how that would affect me but i would like to ask my doctor more questions before i go ahead and try a new product yeah yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. definitely yeah, yeah so, so um you know, you know when, when you, you first went, went into, into the doctor's, doctor's office, office um what, what was, was going, going through your mind, mind? i mean I were you, you, you know, was, you said i was you excited were put at ease. no i was yeah, excited better. i was like this is the time, like, I kept telling my boyfriend, like, this is the time that I think that I'll, I would literally get better. Like, I have my voice heard. Like, I won't feel like I'm getting discriminated because I have proof. Like, I have it. Like, when I go to the hospital or something, and they'd be like, oh, what do you take for your medication? Miss, I'm on medical marijuana. And yes, it helps me a lot. And they just look at me like, you know, that's bad for you. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Go do your research before you think it's bad for you. Because I'm telling you right now, 
I have been off of it. I mean, I have been on it and I have not catch a seizure in a while. And it's amazing, amazing. So when I went to that doctor's, boy, oh boy, I was praying. I was like, this is going to be the time. So That's it. That's it. So, so what, what was, was like your experience, experience with other doctors, doctors though? though? I, I mean, mean they, they, they put, put you on 10 medications. medications. It seemed like they, they were just throwing stuff at you. I, I ended up getting allergic to morphine. I was getting breakouts. Um, I started getting more muscle spasms. Um, a lot of head trauma was coming. Um, back to back with some medications that they were giving me, it was just like... I would get sick and sick and sick. I would be from 150 pounds to 120. I would go down less than that. Um, it was just like, I didn't get help. Like, I was stuck in a place that I was like, what am I going to do? Like, my boyfriend was afraid that he was going to lose me because yeah. there'll be times that I'll catch seizures and it would go on for hours. Like, I mean, hours. People would think a seizure will last five or two minutes. You get me? No, mine will last hours and hours, and he used to be afraid that he could lose me any minute. So it was like, it was a big toll on us. So us moving down here and making a big change within my health was like a blessing. It was like a real big blessing. Yeah, 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 yeah that's, that's huge. huge. I mean, that's, that's priceless. priceless. You can't you put a price on that. that. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, well, um, you, you know, know, for, for those, those who are a little hesitant or skeptical, skeptical what would you say? How do you want to do everything? One second, sorry. I don't use any of this in the Um, What I would tell people is before it's too late, before it's too late, I say to try it. It's not, it's not as bad as what people really think it is. Um. I lost a friend, my boyfriend lost a best friend who died because his parent didn't get to have that opportunity to go ahead and show him what green relief was. And, um, and it was all for a seizure. So I really recommend everybody out there to go ahead and try, if, you have a, if your child has a seizure, try this before you go ahead and keep taking what the hospital gives you. You get me? They, to me, they, it's all gimmicks. They really want your money, and they really want whatever comes with your insurance. Because if I didn't have insurance, they're not going to take care of me. They're not going to care about me. They're just going to be like, Miss, you're going to have to go home or something. With Green Relief, at least, when I went in there, automatically he was concerned on what we have to do next, what can we make to make a faster appointment for you. He was really worried about me having less seizures because, like I said, you could be gone in any minute. A breath could be wasted like this so if you're out there if anyone's out there a mother father look into it before you go ahead and discriminate upon it due to the fact that i am a survivor off of it and one thing i can say is i never tried any other hospitals after a while i never tried any other medication and this is what i reflected on and this is what's helped me i recommend this a hundred percent like literally a hundred percent like it's no joke like if I can put up a sign big enough for everybody to see that it's out there. I would because if I had to travel from New York to come to here to get this, then it, that means it's worth it. Like it's a hundred percent worth it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, Chastity, I appreciate you taking time today to uh, speak with us. And uh, do you have any kind of closing words or anything that you want to tell people before I let you go? Green Relief all the way. They're right there to see me, guys. They're not that far. Meet them up. Call them. They will give you. They will talk to you over the phone. It's not just meet them, guys. I'm telling you. If you have someone sick, anybody hurting and in pain off of any source, it doesn't have to be seizures. It can be chronic. It can be um, anemic. It could be anything. Go ahead and try this because, honestly, if it can help me, I bet it can help you in any other kind of way. And... If the government let this be open, then I mean, take advantage because this is a cure. And I believe that this is going to change the world in any way. But thank you for your time, yeah. guys. No, no thank, thank you. you. And, and uh, we, we enjoy, enjoy having you. you and and uh, we look, look forward to seeing you soon, soon, okay? Bye. <laughs> Bye. All right, perfect. Right.
So there you have it. Uh, that was Chastity Rodriguez. Uh, she's so if uh, you have any hesitations or you're you're not sure, just give us a call um, and just actually spread this uh, video. Let people know what we do and what Green Relief can do for you. Um, you and you heard it just from uh, Chastity. Even if you're not uh, suffering from a you know huge major uh, uh, seizures it's still a good idea to go in, get a second opinion, and see what those doctors at your closest location are going to, uh, to recommend. Because uh, just like Chastity said, there are so many doctors and so many prescriptions that were just being thrown at her uh, and nothing was actually helping her. You know, no, Nobody really took the time to say, okay, what can we do to make this better? It was just run of the mill uh, on to the next. All right, so if you, again, uh, I'm going to put the number in the description uh, to give us a call, set up an appointment, and um, once you get your medical marijuana card, go ahead and start taking at least just some kind of CBD, start getting um, you know, accustomed to the products and the, the, um, and the help that it can offer you because uh, even just getting started on CBD. Uh, personally, I, I use a lot of CBD. Uh, I recommended CBD to friends and family. And it's, it's amazing how quickly people notice the difference. So if you haven't done so already, please set up an appointment and our doctors are going to uh, help you through this process. They're going to walk you through, make sure you feel comfortable and you feel like you're a part of the Green Relief family. All right. So again, my name is Sean. If you have any questions, let us know. Uh, send us a message. Spread uh, the message of what we're trying to do and uh, share this with a friend. Like it comment and share. All right. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.